三甲有必心敬拜主，请听一段的经文：历代之下十五章十二节，因就立约，要尽心尽性，一切求耶和华，因列祖的上帝。十四节到十五节，因就大声欢呼。吹号、吹角，往耶和华起誓；犹大众人为所起的誓，欢喜，因为因是真心起誓，真意切求耶和华，耶和华就予因切着，并且使因四境平安。响声里，同发声音赞美上帝。哈利路亚，哈利路亚，万荣名也光耀日路，万方一音清晨黄昏。哈利路亚，哈利路亚，哈利路。哈利路亚，哈利路亚。轻轻河水长流不歇，熊熊烈火红润光热。哈利路亚，哈利路亚。大地高山无尽宝藏。此生万物花草芬芳，哈利路亚，哈利路亚，哈利路亚，哈利路亚，哈利路亚。人心是人，主受主命，饶恕弟兄，人生一人。哈利路亚，哈利路亚，世人饱受痛苦忧疾，素将有力写给上帝。哈利路亚，哈利路亚，哈利路亚，哈利路亚，哈利路亚。赞美造物主宰，都当真悲伤主敬拜。哈利路亚，哈利路亚，赞美圣父、圣子、圣灵，同声赞美三一真神。哈利路亚，哈利路亚。哈利路亚，哈利路亚，哈利路亚。谁征战？我是上的海洋。谁？真殊胜，美丽西山，万国君王听主上站立，诅咒之物，心慈同欢喜。
神的话语，谁能教导全知的主宰？谁能扯除他奇妙作为？阳光，我们身坐在宝座上，我们来尊重。等恒的苦楚，背负世人所有的过错，用过真身卑微上坟墓。耶稣救主，尽付我长全，阳光我们身，坐在宝座上。你。
真伟大。列王记上三章八到十节，所罗门不伫上帝面前讲：“你所好我诶百姓遐侪，所以求你赐我智慧，通判断跩百姓有法通辨别是非。若无，谁啊有法通判断遐侪诶百姓呢？”所罗门因为安尼求，就望上帝喜悦，无求手术，无求富足，无求灭绝，伊会受得，单单求智慧。上帝就应允伊，使伊聪明智慧，甚至伫以前甲以后无有一个亲像伊。主爱全能的天父上帝，我们感谢俄罗斯荣耀的圣名。巴不得所罗门的经历，成就阮的朋友。伫真难得的机会，所罗门王却无为着家己，心内所挂念的，拢是上帝百姓、上帝代志、上帝国度。主啊，家属今仔日，恁来问我，问阮，阮要怎样回答呢？阮所求的是啥物呢？阮所求的，若毋是健康、财富、权力、地位，阮却只会有法人按照家己的需要来向你祈求，却袂记得了你八讲过，恁着求上帝国甲上帝意，恁跩个需要拢要加乎恁。主啊，阮真是亏欠。阮真是坚守，阮的心心念念拢是为着家己的代志，却无将你的代志放伫心内。主啊，求你除去我，除去阮自私的心、自私的想法，改变阮无知的祈求，让阮有法人体贴你的心意，顺服你的旨意，想你所想，愿你所愿，以基督的心做心，努力正做。行伫你的心意中，听主听人，啊，替传人归恩你，安尼祈祷，奉主耶稣的名，阿门。伊别来书第十章第十九节到二十七节，兄弟啊，咱既然因为耶稣的血得着当年进入至圣座。就借着伊，予咱开了一条国信国话的路，将万啊境界，这万啊就是伊的身体。国有一位大祭司，伫伫上帝的家，国咱心中天良的亏价已经收起，身体用清水洗清了。就着存着诚心，甲创作诶信心来到上帝诶面前，也要经受咱所承认诶期望。无管有当，因为应允咱诶是信实地，搁着彼此三顾，激发贴心，勉励及加好。第二十五节。顶毋通停止聚会，好亲像彼怀停止归死的人，着彼此关念。既然知影迄个日子真近，咱就着个安尼，因为咱知影真多以后，各个以犯罪、赎罪的罪。就阁无有了，只有坚固、听候、审判，甲彼个消灭敌人的热气。Good morning, Church。兄弟姊妹，好早起。In the past two years, we have a better understanding of isolation. 啊，过去两年久的时间，咱开始对这个隔离阁较啊，较个深深的了解了。I am someone who actually enjoys being alone, but even I am sick of social distancing right now. 我个人是一位啊，有时阵真爱单独啊，做做代志的人。但是呢，啊，经过两年后，我现在也是开始啊啊，开始压惯哦这个社交的隔离。Though there are some people who seem to be thriving just being at home. 
most people I've talked to are hungry for face-to-face interaction. And for some of you who want to meet people but still are not able to, I really cannot imagine what you are feeling because isolation can be devastating. But now people are actually starting to meet more. And in churches all around the metro, people are starting to have physical fellowship activities again. But I want to ask you, what is fellowship anyway? If you've been in the church for quite some time, no, you might be picturing an activity where we gather people, perhaps to have fun, to eat together, sing together, hear a message, do an activity, something to learn about God. We actually still do this now. Actually, this weekend, we have a physical fellowship again. But, you know, this is not really what fellowship truly is. That kind of activity is, is a program where we hope that the Christian fellowship will develop. But that means there are many ways to have fellowship. So I think it's helpful to understand what fellowship means first. It means to have a shared goal or interest with other people or a shared mission and purpose. It does not mean only to have fun or to enjoy being with other friends. Christian fellowship is a sharing of something with other believers. We share the same hope in salvation and temptation to sin. We also share the same challenge to love one another. Of course, we will only enjoy or experience the deepest fellowship uh, to only a few believers because we won't really be able to interact with every single believer. But still, every believer does have fellowship with each other because of Jesus. 
，但是呢，咱相信讲每一位的信徒应该要甲其他的信徒啊，有这款的团结，因为耶稣基督的人。And I think a lot of us are not really enjoying this fellowship, even if we are attending activities. 但是我个人的想法是，甲你讲说，现在咱教会有真多兄弟姊妹啊，虽然有咧参加教会真多其他嘅话，真多嘅活动。但是却无咧底下享受到这款团体。Because it is entirely possible to attend worship service, fellowship activities, even small group, to be honest, and not really experience that shared purpose. 因为实在是真有可能讲说，咱有咧参加崇拜会、参加团体活动啊，参小组，但是呢，却无真正的经历到这个共同的目标目标。I don't know if that's you, but if it is, I hope at the end of this message, you will have the desire to experience this. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. This person is not you. If Jesus is the one who is the one, I'm not sure. After the first time, you will start to have a really important experience. Is fellowship really essential to the Christian life? Can't we just focus on our own spiritual growth? 刚才咱问一个问题，就是讲说，伫基督徒嘅生命嘅内面，一个团体敢是真正必要嘅吗？咱敢无法当专注伫咱家己属灵嘅成长嘛？成长嘛 ？Hebrews chapter ten verse nineteen to twenty five tells us why we need the fellowship of fellow believers. 啊，希伯来书第十章十九到二十五节，假使咱为虾米咱需要甲其他嘅信徒有团结？ Now I hope you have your Bibles open as we go through this, because the writer tells us to do three things here. Ah, 我唔忙讲说，当咱呃继续这个信息的时阵，咱就将咱圣经拍开嘞，因为这个作者呢，甲咱讲三项的代志。Verse twenty-two tells us to draw near to God. 第二十二节，假使咱讲的，我们亲近上帝。Verse twenty-three tells us to hold on to our hope. 第二十三章，嗯，叫咱要坚守咱所信念的期望。And in verse twenty-four to twenty-five, it tells us to keep meeting so we can encourage each other. 第二十四到二十五章，鼓励咱唔忙停止聚会，咱就甲继续甲其他信徒做一下，到我当底下彼此来鼓励。These three things are essential to the Christian life. 第三项代志对基督徒嘅生活是基本嘅。But before we do all of this, the writer tells us the reason why we do these things. That's in verse nineteen and twenty. 但是，伫咱做即几项代志之前，即个作者也是解释一个为虾米，咱就需要做即跩代志。一个就是记载一个十九二十七。So it says that the reason we have the confidence to enter the most high place, and because Jesus is our high priest, we can do those three things that were commanded. 所以十九二十七二是甲咱讲说，因为啊，咱我有信心的，就我能进入这个至圣所啊。啊，第二个原因就是耶稣基，因为耶稣基督就是咱的大祭司啊，有法当啊，咱有法当接到伊啊，啊，一边领啊来完成这三项的代志。Now it's important to understand the context. 咱需要了解这个啊，写这项代志的背景啊。One of the reasons why the book of Hebrews was written so that the original, I was because the original audience was wavering in their faith in Jesus, and they were tempted to go back to their old faith and to worship other things. Ah, 咱看的讲说，伊本来是写落来，伊的目的啊，其实上就是要对啊，即跩啊听众啊，因为当时即跩听众啊，开始伫因对耶稣基督的信心顶面开始咧摇动啊。因开始受试探嘛，要学去信因古的诶诶信仰啊，然后啊去啊敬拜啊其他诶物件。But if you read the whole book, no, you will sense that the writer keeps on insisting that the way the new way Jesus offers is far better than anything that came before. 但是当你好好读希伯来书的时，你会发现，讲说作者一直伫遐咧坚持讲说啊，耶稣基督所。好啊，所属的这个新的啊，得救的方法啊，是比其他以前的更加好啊。
the temple in Israel back then had this one section called the most holy place. And there was a curtain separating it from the rest of the temple. And no one is allowed to go there except for the high priest and only once a year. It was a clear message that for all the sacrifices and all the laws of Israel, they could not completely enjoy God's presence yet. That was because of sin. All the sacrifices they did could not really fulfill God's justice completely. But the book of Hebrews declares that Jesus was both the ultimate sacrifice and the ultimate high priest. He was able to completely pay the price with just that one sacrifice. By dying on the cross, by buying it with his own blood, Jesus offers us a new way into the presence of God. So what this means for us is that if we put our faith in Jesus, we can do something that no one was able to do before Christ came. So we can confidently come and enjoy the presence of God without reservation. It's not because we are good people. We are sinners. It is because Jesus fulfills the function of a high priest. On, be, on our behalf, Jesus says to God, this person is clean. I will pay the price for that person. And so we come to God completely clean, purely by grace. So do you understand how significant verse 22 really is? We can draw near to God fully assured that we are clean. Without the use of a temple, without sacrifices, anytime and anywhere. So we are assured we can go into His presence and we are accepted. So when you next have your quiet time, 
think about what Jesus had to do to make that possible. So it and lang kasi pa anjen dia ding siu si tu nan di ho ho su xiong ya so bi to wei dan zui jiao shi mi ni lan jiao wu fa dang lai yong xiu xiong de dong zai. So you can actually enjoy God's presence here and now. Ni an ni dan wu fa dang yong xiu xiong de ah di ji ge so zai ka xian zai lai yong xiu xiong de dong zai. And that is not dependent on the situation you are in or even the state of your heart. That is only because of Jesus. Then not only can we enjoy God's presence because of what Jesus did, we are also able to endure to the end no matter what happens, as verse 23 says. So, ini kan tu, si tan, si tan tan, tu kan yang susu yang te, tong zai ya, lan ya, ah ini ini ya so, lan zui tai cia, lan tang yu, u kan tang di ha, lai ah 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 ah, kian cia, iti kau kau, tui ya, bolun semai tai cia, kau sena, je si ki zai di, di jat san zat ya. To hold fast to the confession of our hope is to keep. Believing and to keep proclaiming that the gospel of Jesus is true. Ah, then that concept, can you then so strong, strong in the bone? Ah, this is the concept. Then to keep the confession. Ah, this is the hope in peace. Ah, keep the ah ah with in the so God kill them, when who them do it, ah, like can keep the confession. It means to be able to say and to believe that because of Jesus, we can enjoy God's presence not just now but forever. Isu di sekolah saya, dan saya nak ikut di kongah ini ya so kita ke yang kau ah, dan saya tang lai yong siu siong te dong zai ah, mesti tan tan yang zai, nai si yang wan ah. That is what it means to hold fast to the confession of our hope. Jadi itu si kian siu lan so siang ni ni cibong ni isu ah. But it says without wavering, meaning we can actually keep doing this until the end, no matter what happens. Ah, tadi lagi ke kongo bu. Now that is because we have the confidence that what Jesus says will happen because He is faithful. It's like what Jesus himself says in Matthew twenty four thirteen when he talks about the end times. He says, "But the one who endures to the end will be saved." Yeah, it is the teaching. Yeah, so Peter, when he did Matthew, he did the teaching. So that is so. Con the con cao this ah, what say is it? So now he con talk talk with ton ton cao to a bit bit difficult. Maybe our journey or our spiritual journey will be tough and will have its up and downs. But those who truly belong to Jesus will actually persevere in the faith until the end. So now we come to verse 24 and 25, and now it involves other believers. The first two commands can be, you know, technically done alone. So you draw near to God and you keep holding on to the confession of your hope. So it is concerned that I think when Shang Te Ah, then I'll then I. Um, can you learn so simply the Chibong? But we cannot do this next one alone. And the second one, the third one, the fourth one, the fifth one, the sixth one, the seventh one. We are told to consider how to stir up one another to love and good works. Ah, in the Liang Xi Zhang Kalang concept, learn the Bi Chu Sa Ko Kia Hua Tian Xin Ma Mian Le Kia Mian Le Kia Hua. Now to consider means to intentionally plan. Ah, this. Ah, ah, pichu, like to a issue, concept, ah, the whole whole, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. 
so right there and then it goes against this notion we have right that we can sometimes just attend church or just be there so it's good way to see the land side comes it to one guy the amalan to go say uh any one to see some got to wait it's right now this already gives the impression that anyone who goes to a any kind of church gathering is expected to plan on how they are going to do this so it's again in holland to one what is love and good works? That just means to be able to act out your faith, to actually obey the commands of Jesus, that we love each other. Again, to see, 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 to now, how do we do this? By not neglecting to meet together, as is the habit of some, but encouraging one another, and all the more as you see the day drawing near. Some people at that time apparently gave up on this, as perhaps we will feel like doing at one point or another. But the writer says, no, it is essential that you keep doing this. You have to keep encouraging each other, and that actually gets more and more urgent as the day is nearing. This is the day that Jesus returns. So why? What happens when this day approaches? Now listen to Matthew chapter 24, verse 10 to 13. Let me read it to you. And then many will fall away and betray one another and hate one another. And many false prophets will arise and lead many astray. And because lawlessness will be increased, the love of many will grow cold. But the one who endures to the end will be saved. Uh, no one knows when this day will be, but it is approaching. We gather to help prevent each other's hearts to grow cold. We are meant to encourage, shake, rebuke, excite, inspire, and do whatever we can to help each other go to Jesus and not sin. You are not meant to do all of this alone. Our passage did not specify what type of gathering we should do, but it just assumes that the church does keep gathering. But this passage applies to every single gathering we do as believers, whether it's a worship service, a small group, or even just eating, eating together to catch up. 
，所以这段经文在咧甲咱讲的是啊，包括所有款的啊，信徒的的的的组织的的的所在，就是包括啊，崇拜会，包括小组，或者是公司主餐，也是等等。You must consider how to encourage whoever you are meeting with to love and good works. 所以，咱每一摆甲人相处的时阵，咱就好好思想，就怎啊底下甲人彼此来鼓励，啊，行来啊，结发天性，变成更好。Fellowship is essential. You cannot grow without it. 所以，这个团体是第基本的。咱若无这团体，咱会真艰苦，穷尽。You are in danger without it. 是上难。那无团体，咱会面对着一挂个危险。To be isolated from other believers is to face the temptations alone. 当咱大买家己隔离个时阵，咱就是啊，着单独来面对所有个试探。To be honest, your chance of winning is very low. 当你安尼单独做个时阵，你啊，这个啊，得胜个机会是真正微小个。So Perhaps I'm not talking to the newcomers, but there is little value in being part of a church for so long and only being a spectator. Ah, 当然我唔是对在新来朋友说，我担心呢。当你是啊，伫一个教会内面，啊啊，真只一个教会一部分，但是你确实定定做一个旁观者的时阵呢，所以这款就就无虾米价值。If you have had no involvement at all in our church or in any church, what I want to say to you is that you probably need to be able to cut out some things in your life. Jesus, ah, you in the church, ah, is in the in the church, ah, the church, the church, no time for any other time. Ah, you, I am saying, I want to tell you, let me tell you, say, you start to do some other things in the church, and try to reduce some of them. I'm not talking about emergencies or having extreme situations you are in. And it's really not about missing, missing out on some gatherings every so often. We actually all have different situations and different capacities on what we can do, so we we shouldn't compare. Ah, in the end, 大家人拢无相关的情况的下面，也咱也是无相关的能力通参加啊，咱有法通做的代志，所以咱无法通底下来比较。But when we say we are too busy always or too tired that we have zero. Involvement with other believers, then I think it is time for the evaluation. But is when we are talking about it, we are not busy, not busy, so we are not talking to other believers. Then we are talking about it. 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 Because then we are actually saying that it is okay in our business. To risk drifting away from God and sinning because there is no one encouraging us. Lan ani zui di si lan ni isu le kong se ah lan ah jin jia bo yi si bo bun dui ah lan ni guan yi yin yi lan ni bo yi lai ah lai wan ah wan li xiong de lian ao ah ah huan zui yin yi bo zhi ge lang. And we are also saying with that that it is acceptable to risk other people sinning because you were not there to encourage them. Alan, the issue is that there is a point in how people look at this kind of thing. It is to say, ah, to avoid, ah, because we are not there to encourage people to sin. So I urge you reflect on this. Perhaps talk to someone if you need to. 所以我直接肯变咱好好来思考这项代志，啊，现在啊，就需要甲其他的人来沟通。Talk to us pastors, perhaps. 现在甲阮跩啊，团队人讲话。But I want you to carve out the time you need to be able to meet with other believers. 但是我真加肯定，呃，啊
，挖出时间来啊，甲其他信徒来聚会。So what what meetings and gatherings should you be attending then？ 所以我就要问讲说，到底你想讲说，我应该得参加什么款的聚会啊，还是团体呢？ Oh, I well, I think it would be good to meet as many as you are able. 当然，你若问我，我爱讲说，你若尽力力量参加，如最是如何。I also want to point out, however, that part of the good work we are supposed to be doing is to be、uh, witnesses and to preach the gospel outside. 我也是爱支持讲说，咱所讲的咧行好，其中一项就是咱得往外口的人啊，底下来做见证，并且传扬福音。To keep meeting together does not mean that we live in a、uh, sort of Christian bubble where we just keep meeting the same people over and over again. Ah, then concept to maintain the church. This is not just a general concept. We are just in the ah, we are in the church community. 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 But in the process of engaging people outside the church, you will need encouragement. But is when we start to talk to my friends, the people who start to talk to me, we need encouragement. So you must, you must keep meeting. Because we need to talk to my friends and we need to talk to our friends. Again, we have different situations, and you should not feel guilty if you really cannot attend this or that gathering. Ah, 当然，咱的情况，大家人拢无相同，所以当你无法能参加其中一项还是两项的聚会的时阵，你也免感感觉心内感觉到啊啊啊困难。But I urge you to keep intentionally planning on how to do this. Why, 咱大家啊，调高意的就是固定。来想看，计划要怎样安尼来做。If if after carving out the time, you know, you find that there is only one single meeting you can do, you can go to, then I urge you do it still. You go there to encourage and be encouraged. 当咱超过咱的点钟以后，也过啊，最后咱发现讲咱只能参，我能参加一个聚会，一款的聚会呢，也是未要紧，咱就是得安尼去做。咱就来参加啊，行底下鼓励，并且得到鼓励。One specific meeting I want to urge everyone to be more intentional is this Sunday gathering. 这个真正啊啊啊，明天呢，我爱咱啊，身边大家人就啊，跳过意来参加的，就是咱的主日崇拜会。Now some of you would have strong reasons you cannot go. Please do not feel guilty about this. 现在咱中间一寡人，咱有一个真啊真啊强的一个理由，咱无法能参加，咱唔通感觉内疚。But if you are able to go, and all it takes is an adjustment, for example, you just need to wake up earlier. I urge you to come here on a Sunday. 啊，耶稣，你是有法当安尼做，但是需要只需要底下做一寡安排，亲像较早起来呢。我实在是肯定要来参加聚会 ，because I want that mutual encouragement to happen。我爱讲说啊，彼此鼓励这项代志发生。Do you think that that the Sunday gathering is all just about singing some songs and then listening to a preacher and then going home？ 你想做主日崇拜会，只不过是来参加唱一寡歌，参加听道理，然后。No, you are an active participant, and you are expected to talk to whoever you can, so that you can encourage. And the key is, we are not a passive participant. We are a active 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 participant. As a servant of God, you are actually my co-worker and not my audience. Then the key is to say, ah, to a certain extent, the problem is, you are my audience, you are not my audience, you are my audience. 
if you are willing to do so after hearing this, but you don't know how, then come to me. I'll go with you as we do this. If you are only able to join us online, then there may be a little more work you have to do because it's a little bit harder to encourage others online. But it is not impossible. Now, at the very least, perhaps you can start calling up friends, messaging friends. Uh, but please plan and you do it. So church, let us consider how we can stir up one another to love and good works. So UCG, God bless you. And now uh, let us receive the benediction. Father God, thank you for this time that we have to gather again, even online or face to face, to just listen to your word and encourage each other. I pray, even for those who are listening online, they would uh, feel have this conviction that they can actually go and reach out and encourage and to have that realization that indeed everyone needs this even the pastors need this we all need this for someone to go and talk to us and encourage us to pray for us to stir us up to love and good works because our hearts will grow cold with all the busyness and the anxiety and the things that are happening in day-to-day -day life so I pray as a church, we would take that step for that real fellowship to start happening. And now may the God of endurance and encouragement grant you all to live with such, in such harmony with one another in accord with Christ Jesus so that together you may with one voice glorify the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. This we pray in the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. Simply resting